Booties for Black Girl Nerds. I enjoyed the show. I watched um, the first two episodes. Cool. Nice. And can you tell me what made you guys say yes to the script? Well, I mean, just first of all, like, what is this? You know, it's yeah. both like amazingly kind of vivid on the page, but at the same time, you're like, wait, this hasn't been created, and we have the opportunity to make this. I thought that was really exciting. Plus, just the family drama that yeah. it is. I think it was hands down the best just pilot script I've ever read in my life. Mm. You know, where it's like, all right, Game of Thrones is really great at first episode. I'm like, eh, eh. you know what I mean? Like, mm -hmm. the whole thing is phenomenal. But just as a pilot, as itself, not knowing anything more, I was totally hooked. Hadn't read anything like it. To go from the pregnancy to the battle, to it's not his kids, to like, what the fuck yeah. is going on? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Super hooked. And uh, and I was really interested to, to play this character, and I hadn't done this in my career yet, so, mm -hmm. yeah. Mm -hmm. Sure, and then can you guys give me more insight to the twin's biological father? Because mm -hmm. um, I know your character is very secretive about what your relationship was, yeah. and then your character, because you are their adoptive father, what? How do? You, how does your character feel about him? Like truly? I, d I mean, I don't want to give too much away, because I would be. It's complicated. Let's put it that way. It's mm -hmm. very complicated. I mean. You know, first of like all, most just families. like yeah, like most families, and yeah. we what we know here is we have someone who's giving birth to twins, uh, of someone you know the father is someone who's not around. That's already complicated, and we don't know much about it. That's very complicated too. Yeah, if a woman stumbles into your village and she's pregnant and she's fall in love with her, that's mm -hmm. well, I can't be mad. She yeah. showed up that way. Yeah, it's the way she showed up. Yeah. Obviously, she's alone. She needs help. Yeah. The other guy's not here. Yeah. We've talked about that. She's come alone, so it's not like mm -hmm. she's just like, oh, he's, you know, he's off hunting. No, no, like, exactly. We know that she, there's no man around. Yeah. So. Mm -hmm. And you guys start off very strong in your partnership, being very honest with one another, yeah. and then um, the character Paris kind of mm -hmm. advises you. What it, um, she says, uh, silence isn't a lie. Yeah. So. How, well, I know you can't tell it, but can you mm. tease how that will play out for your relationship when that is revealed? Well, there's gaps in our relationship of which I'm personally say I, I don't need to know your past. Mm. Mm -hmm. I love you for what you are. Yeah. Like, Baba needs to get into all those complications. That's what's kind of nice yeah. about Baba. For both of them, yeah. I think. I yeah. think they're not too kind of like, it's not all about, it's like that line I say, you know, I, I'd rather have a man who can carry me than someone who understands me. Mm -hmm. And I think there's a lot of truth in it. I mean, this, this is not about some story and some what's right and what's wrong. It's about this, what they feel for each other and what's here and now. And I think, um, yeah, that's what matters the most. But of course, you know, it's gonna, this is going to lead to... With your secrets. <laughs> I mean, it's going to lead there somewhere. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Better shake your booties for black girl nerds.